Hello everybody, I'm Jackie K. Cooper and my entertainment rundown for today is a review of the film Kandar. And it stars Gerard Butler. He plays a, an agent for the, for the government who is on a covert mission in Afghanistan and he you know, is doing some damage to property and getting secrets, etc. And it comes time for him to get out you know, to, to leave the country, and there's some problems, and he's trying to get his assistant translator uh, out with him to, to save his life, and that's what the whole crux of the movie is, the pursuit of them and how they are, are trying to get out of the country and back to safety. Gerard Butler has turned into Liam Neeson, kind of. They just make these movies that are good, you enjoy them, and then they just disappear out of your mind. Just poof. You know, I, when I was reviewing Kandahar, I was thinking, let me remember exactly what it was. I remember it wasn't, wasn't bad, or, you know, I had a good time with But it's not nothing outstanding. And in this case, the character that Gerard Butler played, I never had a real clear take on him as a personality. And, and you know, any kind of real relationships or, or even backstory. He stars along with Naveed Degabon and Travis Bimmel. They're the three main stars of the film. The film is rated PG-13 because there's profanity and violence. It's exciting in parts, but I just, you know, if, you, if you're going to sit there, you want to see something a little bit special. Gerard Butler used to kind of give it that extra kick, but his last few movies have just been almost by-the-book movies. And it's plots that you've seen in other situations, you know, just with a little bit of a twist on them or whatever. So I, I was okay watching it, but I didn't get excited about it. So I scored it 5 out of 10, just average. Uh, not a waste of your time, but not something you want to make a real effort to go see either. It, it'll entertain you, and then you'll forget it. But this has been Jackie K. Cooper's Entertainment Rundown with a review of the movie Kandahar.